welcome back to Enrajini Kiran, my YouTube channel. This video is going to present you about the block diagram of computers. Very important topic. So when you look to the block diagram of computers, to the left hand side there is an input box and in the middle there is a CPU that is a central processing unit and to the right hand side there is an output device. Within the CPU there are three components, one control unit, second one arithmetic and logic unit and third one is memory unit. And input, input devices are connected to the CPU, processing will take place in the CPU and then the output is given to the output devices. So let us see what is an input device. Input devices are the devices which are used by the user to give the information to the system like say for example keyboard, mouse and scanner. In the central, then after the input data is given or instruction is given to the CPU, what happens in the CPU? What all the three components are going to perform? Arithmetic logic unit is going to perform arithmetic and logical operations like arithmetic op operations means addition, subtraction, multiplication, division and mod operations. Logical operations means logical and, logical or, logical not. And these logical operations are used by uh, relational expressions where in relational expressions we use relational operators less than less than or equal to, greater than, greater than or equal to, equal to, not equal to. So these operations are performed by arithmetic logic unit. Control unit is the one which is going to control the operations of all the parts of the computer. It controls the flow of data in all other parts of the computer such as input, output and memory. Memory unit is the unit which is going to store the input data, instructions, intermediate data as well as output data. And the output devices or the devices which are going to produce a result where these results are viewed by the user. Example, monitor or printer, plotter and speaker. Thank you for watching this.